welcome to my channel. My name's Rebecca and you have got the pleasure of Sir Alfie as well in the building today. If you are brand new, you're probably kind of wondering like, what is this video all about? Who is Harvey? What happened to him? Um, I'm gonna be sharing so much in this video. So before you do anything, make sure you go and subscribe to the channel and you turn on those notifications because we have got some epic stuff coming your way plus some giveaways. And if you have been around for a while, then if you know about Harvey, one, I absolutely love you guys because that means that you have been supporting me for years and years and years. And seriously, you guys are the reason that I wake up every day and I make more videos. It's not for me and it's definitely not for Alfie. So thank you guys. And I know you have been asking this question over and over again. I see it all the time on my Instagram and my Facebook and on the blog, like, where is Harvey? So I am gonna be sharing in with you a little bit about who Harvey is for those of you who knew and uh, what did happen to him. And if you wanna see more videos from Alfie and I, I think that he actually just enjoys the spotlight even more now because all the attention is on him. If you wanna see more of Alfie in my workouts, you can actually check out the video playlist on my website. And this video is also sponsored by Squarespace. They are an amazing way if you wanna create a brand new website, super easy, you can just move the templates around. They've got 24 hours customer support. So if you're struggling with building a website, you don't have to go and pay a developer thousands and thousands of dollars. It's super easy, you can also use my discount code just go to squarespace.com forward slash Rebecca Louise, all the details in the description below, and you can set up a very, very easy website, super fast. You can have a blog, you can sell stuff on there, you can share, you know, who you are and what you're about. And if you guys actually have a business too, and you have a website, or if you've made a Squarespace website, please just drop it below because I want to see what you guys are doing. I want to see who the people are in my community um, and reach out to you guys and tell you guys you're doing awesome because you're incredible. So if you do have a website, um, a Squarespace website, just drop it below and I'd love to check it out. Okay, so that's our little introduction. I kind of like to be like excited when I do videos, but this one's actually really difficult for me, to be honest. Um, and so I guess let's just watch some clips of Harvey and who he is. Harvey was a dog that I rescued four years ago. Um, I wasn't planning to get another dog, and I had Alfie at the time, so I brought him over from England, and I was actually on the way to get some contact lenses, and I was with um, my boyfriend at the time, and we were driving to go and get my contact lenses, and we were like, oh, let's just go and like have a look in the doggy pound. Like, who does that? This is, you know, disclaimer, disclaimer, disclaimer. Do not one day just think, oh, I need to go and like have a look at like the dogs in the in the dog kennel. Do not do that because you will walk away with one. So we went in there and this Harvey, oh my goodness, he came up to like his the little pen and he was just so docile. Like you go up to stroke him and he would just like flop back. Not like this one who as soon as you like try and like touch him, he'll like bite you. He was just so docile, he could play fetch, so we like played with him, which like this one also can't do. I'm sorry, Alfie, I'm like completely dissing you right now. I love you, I love you a lot, but there was something very special about Harvey too. Um, and he was just like this beautiful dog and he was so docile and he loved, they loved each other. They would go in the same crate, they would sleep together, they would sleep like cuddled up. I'm showing you guys some pictures right now about how much they loved each other. And he was just the cutest dog, he was just, he was so cuddly, he was like spangly. Like you could like pick him up by his arms and legs and kind of like, he was just like super bendy and loving. He was a little bit crazy when we first got him because he would like gnaw at the cage because he wanted to get out. And that was kind of quite stressful, kind of having two, <laughs> two dogs that were like rattled with each other. Um, but they just, they had so much love between each other. And I think that was the hardest thing for me when I didn't have him anymore was like seeing how sad Alfie is. Now he's absolutely fine now, by the way, like he's absolutely fine. And um, so what did happen to him? So when me and my uh, ex-boyfriend, we broke up, um, he came in and he took Harvey um, because I was gonna keep Alfie. So that's kind of like where he went. I believe that 
he was about seven months old when we got him, so he's probably coming up to like five, you know, years old. He lives in Long Beach somewhere in Southern California. I have never seen him uh, since he was just taken out of that out of the house from me. And it's kind of sad, I really wish I could like check in and see him, but it's just, unfortunately, that's just not gonna be the case. Um, it's actually my name on the adoption paper. I still have his, yeah, I still have his adoption paper. I can't bear to like let that go. So um, I don't know, maybe there's a way that I could get him back, but I just don't, I don't think it's like worth like going into that. I don't know if you guys have had like any issues before where maybe you've split up with somebody and like someone's got the dog or the cat or the reptile or the turtle, you know, I don't know. Maybe you could like drop me a comment and let me know kind of how it works. But to be honest, I just don't think it's worth going down that road to like try and get him back. Um, Alfie is amazing. I do think a lot about getting another dog. Um, and I guess everyone has this when they've already had a dog. They're like, how are they going to compare? Because I've had Harvey and like Alfie is literally my best friend. It's sad. Um, but he is amazing. Uh, so I don't know if like he needs a friend. I don't know if he'd be annoyed that I get another dog because he's kind of like independent, stubborn and um, a little bit difficult sometimes. Um, so I'm not really sure. I don't know. What do you guys think? Do you think like Alfie needs a friend or maybe just like, you know, we need to, we need to bring more dogs into the videos. I don't even know. But um, yeah, that's a little bit of information about where Harvey is. And yes, I feel really sad that he's not in my life anymore. Um, I'm sure he's living an incredible life and, you know, having lots of fun and going to the dog beach in, in Long Beach and, you know, just enjoying the doggy life. So I'm sorry that I don't have a Harvey anymore. There's another little dog in the videos called Stinky Girlfriend. She's my friend's dog. We're thinking about adding in some other dogs in some of the workouts just to see how Alfie, Alfie reacts to that. And it's funny because he's actually sat here the whole time we've done this video. Do you know that we're talking about Harvey? Who's Harvey? Who's Harvey? Oh, maybe he knows who Harvey is. He doesn't normally sit with me this whole time, but he's been very good. I don't know, maybe he like knows I'm talking about him or something. Oh, I'm sorry, bud. Do you think we should get you a friend? Should we get you a friend? Okay, guys, well, thanks so much for joining me. Um, I hope that answers your question. I know you guys have been asking me for like forever, where is Harvey? So basically I adopted him, me and my boyfriend broke up. He took that dog, I took Alfie, and I haven't seen him since, so. It's okay, at least I've got this little guy. If you've got any stories, then just drop it below. I'd love to hear from you guys. Subscribe to the channel, and I'll hopefully I'll see you guys on the next video. Love ya!